Hello, my gorgeous ones. Welcome to Alicia Budget Beauty. My name is Alicia. Here on my channel, I am a sucker for affordable fashion and beauty. I do hauls, tutorials, reviews, try-ons, all sorts of fun stuff. So if that sounds good to you, please subscribe, stick around, be a friend. All right, you guys, I have another haul from Gorge Glitter. I did a try-on haul from them not too long ago. They sent over eight more items to me. So I'm going to tell you guys my honest thoughts on the quality, how I think that they look and feel and try them on for you guys. So if you want to see a little try on of affordable fashion and get my honest opinions, keep on watching. All right, you guys, I also apologize if you hear any background humming, that is our gaming trailer that we own and it is being all booted up for the weekend party. So if you hear that buzzing, I'm really, really sorry. Let's go ahead and get into the items. Now, the first one is this dress that I am currently wearing. This is a chocolate, one shoulder ruched, very stretchy form fitted dress. I will show you guys at the end, the try on, so don't you worry, but this is a mid, mid thigh dress, but it also can kind of be adjusted. When you have all these ruching, you can kind of adjust how short or long it fits to the body. So if I wanted it a little bit longer and less ruched, I could pull it down, but I like a good, you know, ruching. It gives really good body shape. So that being said, is about mid thigh on me. And then it does have this crisscross that I think is really, really pretty here. I love the one sleeve. This color is so rich and gorgeous for the fall and honestly this is one of the better quality pro products better quality items that came in this haul there are some that aren't quite as good as others and i will be honest about that but this one i think is very very nice quality i could see wearing this to date night any type of event even a holiday event after you know fall i think this would be appropriate even for a christmas party if you're not a red or green or like sparkly girl I think this would be really really beautiful so again stay tuned to the end and I'll do all the try-ons for you guys at the end maybe in a voiceover like last time so just be patient all right the next item is this knit dress knit black dress and it has this sheer panel in the center that's supposed to give the illusion of those bodice type of like corset dresses and then it let's see this is going to hit about to the knee and you do have this mock neck here this material is very soft it's that kind of like silky knit material that is slightly thin i don't believe this will be see-through which is good but it's also not you know it's not like a, a thick bodycon not a bandage type of dress it's just a thin knit material but i think this one is decent quality i think this will be one that once it's on it has a little bit more appeal once you know it shapes to the body i could definitely see wearing this with some you know booties maybe a knee high boots if it's chilly of course you could just wear it with you know some high heels and keep the legs bare if you want i could also see this with a really pretty trench as well so i'm excited to try that on here in a little bit now I will give you guys the little tip when you are shopping these affordable sites a lot of times they come and they're very very wrinkly and I feel like that automatically makes it look like it's not as good quality be a little bit patient get the wrinkles out and then reassess because this vest is actually really really nice looking and really nice quality but when it first came, it was really wrinkly and I didn't think it looked as nice. But now that the wrinkles are out, I think this looks super nice. So this does have this little sash here that goes through the loops and belts. And then it does have the button. And I'm excited to try this on. I think this would be really, really pretty. I can see this being really pretty just with you know, like a bandeau underneath and just bare and with some nice pants. I could also see it being pretty with like a turtleneck underneath, a red turtleneck, a bodysuit, maybe even another collared shirt, a white collared shirt. I mean, there's a lot that you could do with this. You could even put it over a dress, cinch it up like this. I just think this is a really beautiful piece and was much better quality than I was anticipating. Now this next item is another example. You've got to get the wrinkles out. When this came, I thought it looked terrible. 
And then now I think it does look better. It's still not really as structured as I'd like for it to be. It's a little bit flimsy, the material, but it is one of those open center corseted looking illusion type of shirts as well. Um, I do think this is will be prettier on. I just wish that you see how it's kind of floppy and I like a crisp white shirt. This is more of like a, a loose cotton instead of a stiff cotton. But I do think once I get it on, I might like it a little bit better, but definitely get those wrinkles out again. Now this dress was a little bit different than I anticipated. I'm still fine with it. It's just not the material I thought it was gonna be. So it is one of those kind of mesh net overlays over the spandexy polyester lining. So I like that it's not see-through. It is nice and thick. And then here's what the straps look like. I do think this would be obviously better for summer and springtime. It's a little bit, right now, if I were to wear it, I would feel like the Grinch, which could actually be kind of cute if you're going for like a holiday party and you're gonna go as the Grinch, but you still wanna look kind of like classy and like a nice sexy dress and you could wear this but it is a long dress and it does have a slit that doesn't go too high it'll probably be just below the knee it does have all this type of ruching effect so it's very stretchy and it should form to the body and look pretty nice so I'm not too disappointed with it it's just not exactly what I thought it was going to be but again we'll have to put it on and see how we like it now this is the other piece that I think is my favorite. Of course, I haven't tried them on yet, all of them, but this I love because the quality feels so nice. And then this feels like very, very nice quality. So this is a two piece set and is a skirt and a little top. Now the top does look childlike, but it's super stretchy. So think of it like a, a much more covered sports bra. Like it is gonna stretch and have everything covered. It's not gonna be too small, I can tell, but it is nice and thick. It doesn't have any frays, any strands that are hanging off. And then the skirt is also extremely thick. The band for the waist is nice and thick. So I'm very, very impressed with this quality. This again is something a little bit more, I'd say like springtime, um, because it is thicker, it might be a little bit warm in the summertime, but I just don't look at this and really think like fall, winter. However, so yeah, I think you could maybe layer this up to work for right now if you put on some boots underneath. You could actually probably put this over some sort of, you know, like long sleeve, black, maybe, you know, to the form fitted to the body bodysuit and get away with layering it up. But quality, very, very impressed. Now this last item, I don't know. It's not my favorite in quality, at least from first impressions. I think that this little cardigan is okay. Um, it is a very, very lightweight kind of so, like in between a cotton and a knit sweater. Um, I like the little buttons on it. There are these little faux pearls. I do like this color. I think that's pretty. The thing that I'm a little bit like eh about is this dress because you, you do have these straps and they're very, they're very, very thin as well. So I'm just thinking, I don't know how long they would hold up. I could imagine this tearing at some point and it is looks like it'll be about it's just above the knee i do think this will be a cute little set though together it just may not be something that holds up for very long but i do think it's nice and classy with the little cardigan definitely can see this with some little boots i could see it you know with some heels i think this is appropriate for a lot of places you know you could leave it open if you wanted to show a little bit more skin you could keep it buttoned up if you want to be more conservative but quality wise i'm just not too sure on this one but we shall see once we try everything on all right, here is the brown dress, and I really love how it fits to the body. I love the ruching. I also love that you can adjust it and pull it down, make it a little bit longer, and customize it to your needs. 
Here we have the vest, and as you can see, it belts on the side, so you can adjust it as tight or loose as you would like. You can also unbutton it and have it open, which I really enjoy. And I did wanna show you guys the texture of the dress. As you can see, it is very thick, not see-through at all, and it does fit to the body so nicely. Now we have the two-piece outfit, and like I was saying before, this is a thicker material, so you cannot see through it, which is a bonus. I love how it fits to the body, but it also has a lot of stretch to it, so it's very comfortable. And like I was also saying, the top is more stretchy than it looks like, and it's not so tiny. Now here we have the knit black dress with the mesh paneling, and I really like this dress more than I thought that I would. I think that it looks pretty classy, but yet sexy. And here is a close-up of the center, as you can see. It just gives that peekaboo, but it's still fairly conservative. And then here we have the white blouse with the mesh paneling. As I was saying, I wish so much that this was a thicker, more structured material. I do think that it's very nice, though, from far away. Up close, I just think it looks like it could be a little bit nicer done. Now, here is the knit oatmeal cami dress. I will say the material is incredibly soft, very, very comfortable. Here is the cardigan that comes with it. I don't think that this is really my style. That is throwing me off a bit. And I do think that the buttons are sewn a little bit wonky, so it doesn't look as nice buttoned up shown here. I will say this is my favorite way to wear it is open. You can't tell that the buttons are off too much. And I do think this is the cutest style if you're interested in this set. I am actually very pleasantly surprised with this dress. I do forget to say this at the end of the video that this was one of my favorites. I'm a little thrown with the color. It's just not this time of year, although I still think this could be a fabulous Grinch-inspired glam dress, but I love this ruching here. It is not see-through, and I just think it's so pretty on. All right, you guys, I've tried everything on, and I... I really think that my favorites are still this dress and the two piece, this one right here. Love these. I also really, really love the vest. The rest of the items I think are likes, maybe not loves. I would have loved the white blouse, corsety blouse, if it was just a little bit more structured, but really for the price, it wasn't too bad. You guys will have to let me know what your favorites are in the comments. Remember, I do have a code with Gorge Glitter if you do want to order from them. That will be on the screen, or it's probably already flashed on the screen, and then it will also be linked in the description. You guys have to let me know what is your favorite, and as always, have fun shopping, budget shopping. Bye!